team has uncovered new information tonight about an incident at the Charles Webster Detention Center that landed six now former deputies in jail themselves. All six still face charges in Richmond County. But two of them just pleaded guilty to federal charges. Melissa Morello and Daniel Diversa are now waiting to be sentenced and they might have some company as your I team's Meredith Anderson shows us even more federal charges could follow. That's because these new documents, Melissa Morello and Daniel Diverse's plea agreements in federal court, hint others were involved. And then there's Melissa Morello's body cam video. We first showed you this exclusive video earlier this year. A source gave it to me who wanted to expose what really happened that day. And after we posted it, the case has gotten even more attention. On the ground! Here, bring him over here! Bring him over here! Now we learn the woman wearing the camera says she's guilty of depriving an inmate of his civil rights. Daniel Diversa, another now former deputy, admits the same. Both plea agreements point to a specific moment, seemingly captured on Morello's body cam. Morello is the only female voice you'll hear. We'll identify Diversa and his voice. It's difficult to make out, but the inmate isn't happy about his face in the water and insinuates he might do something about it if he wasn't handcuffed. Video shows Morello try to remove the cuffs, but before he's even able to stand up, you can see he's punched. Then he's tackled in a chokehold. Diversa admits to shouting about the inmate wanting his handcuffs removed. Morello admits to trying to get the cuffs off, but says she was unsuccessful and another deputy actually removed them. Both say they failed to intervene when the inmate was attacked. Again, the federal charges and federal guilty pleas so far only apply to two people, Diversa and Morello. While these new documents discuss an inmate being assaulted, they do not name others involved. They simply say Deputy 1 and Deputy 2. Yeah, but six were arrested in Richmond County, including Morello and Diversa. What about those charges? Well, those charges still stand. That is a completely separate case. Now, think back to the Ahmad Aubrey case. He was the black man shot and killed while jogging. Three white men were found guilty of a list of state charges, including murder. Then they were found guilty on federal hate crime charges. So we're talking about a same incident, different court cases, same with this, same incident, different court cases. Absolutely. Much more to come to this. We know or come of this and we know uh, you'll stay on top of that. Meredith, thank you. Albert